This is a walkthrough guide of all of the hacking levels in episode 8 of Dispatch. This is for the Hacked by Robert achievement and trying to get all of the hacking levels complete. There are four hacking levels in this episode, and I've put chapters in the video if you want to skip ahead. But during your first shift, you're going to have a tracking issue as you try to find some of your heroes from the Z team. So you can hack in here and isolate where they are. This first one is fairly straightforward. Obviously, you can see the antivirus program that's going to activate as you move in there. So you're going to have to evade it. Don't go into the top or it's going to trap you like this. And out of those two nodes, the one at the top I'll show you in a moment is very long. I think it's about six digits long. Whereas that one on the right is very short. So let me just show you what this looks like. Six digits here. I can barely get it done. So go for the other one first. It's going to give you a lot more runway and place to uh, trick that antivirus into going. Go over there now and just do it really quick. It's up, up, easy. So now you've got this huge rectangle here. You can just lure it all the way up to the top. And you have plenty of time now to punch in this code and not panic. We'll just give it a little bit more of a runway around the square and we'll go finish off this hacking mission. You've got the electrical charge should you need it. It's going to zap it and get rid of any more pressure as you just finish off this mission here. All right, going back to our grid here. Now we got to isolate the sim signal. If you go directly to the right, you're going to get it and then go straight up, I think about three squares up. So it's up here in the top right area. And that'll be that for that first hacking mission. Let's move ahead in the mission to the second, which is going to appear like this. It doesn't matter which of the ones you track, just whichever hero you prefer to have back on your team first. I believe both the hacking missions are the same, but let me know if that's not the, the true. So for this one, we are going to open up another grid here where we're trying to find the signal. It's at the very top left. We'll head up there in a moment. That's where we came from. Let's go back up to the top left here. And I see that that's going to open our, our grid for our antivirus, but we can also trap it there. After you've matched your, your signal here, you are going to see a second signal, which is actually over in that top square where the virus program is now. So I've opened that second bridge so that we have a bit more space to, to move. So we're just going to wait for it to come out and lure it down and go all the way up into the top right where it was before. Let's give it an extra square just in case it comes over and gets you. All right, that's the second hacking level down. We'll, we'll move ahead to the next two, which are going to get a little bit more challenging. Aside from achievement hunting, the other thing I'm trying to defeat is YouTube and growing my channel. So I'll pop up a ham steak at the very end. If you don't mind going over to the channel to subscribe, that would help me out immensely. But enough about that, let's get back to the hacking. So during your second shift here, this is further along into the episode, you are going to have a lockdown at one of the student uh, schools. You're going to come in here and try to free the students. This one's a little bit easier. It's more of a like a maze just trying to get through. So you need four digits to get there. And there is an electrical charge at the top right here. So let's go all the way around. We'll collect it. We'll make this bridge, get our code. So left, left, right, up. We have two charges that we're going to have to play with as we go through here. This is the first one here. So can't get through there. We got to go make the first charge. We're going to open this next bridge, grab the second charge, carry it down to make the second bridge. Now that we're in the center here where we need to be, it's going to make a little bridge out so that you can go back and collect oh both of those charges. Uh, I made a mistake here. We can't go up to that one. So let's go to the one on the, you can come up through to the right first collect this guy here and that's going to reopen the bridge that you took back to get it the first time deposit your first charge go out and around all the way and then this time you're going to go the opposite direction when you go to return it so down to the left counterclockwise after that you just go through and punch in your last code and that's going to cap us off for the third hacking mission all right this is going to bring us to the last one 
I wouldn't say it's the hardest one. I think the vault mission in episode six was a little harder. But during your, let's call it the third shift, after everyone starts going over time, you're going to get this defeat mind effer mission pop up here. So this one does mess with your mind a little bit. You make your way to the end. There's nothing here. You have to go back to your left. All the way over to your left. I was just testing to see if there was any invisible walls there. And now that you're here, you go back to your right again. And you start to see things open up. From here on, that won't happen again, but what will happen is sort of invisible walls. So let's go back all the way to the right. And you, you don't need to go to the left like I did. You can just punch right through this wall. Just key over to the right once more. It's a path. You're going to have to do that again, but this time with something pursuing you. So keep moving to your right as fast as you can. You can get into this grid. Now your controls are reversed. So left is going to take you right. Up is going to take you down. It takes a moment or two to get used to, but the same for your passcodes. So this one would be uh, up, left, right, down. There are some more invisible walls. Let's just key in these first so that we don't have to make too many jumps. You're going to go over to the left, punch across, and then do the opposite code once again. So right, left, up, up, down, right, and then go complete your mission. Hopefully that helps you out. And if it is your successful last hacking level, you're going to get the Hacked by Robert achievement. If not, I've got some videos to go back to some previous episodes and get it all. Either way, I hope it